And at the top of today's show, a follow-up to a story we've been covering here. The so-called Monsanto Protection Act signed into law more than a week ago by the president. Uh, there was a little non-notice provision of a larger bill to fund agricultural spending over the next six months. It essentially gives genetic modified crops and the companies who make them immunity from court intervention, even if they are a public health risk. Since we've started following the story, some other outlets have followed our lead. Let's take a listen. Let's at least then hear some of Congress's, no doubt, robust discussion on this controversial amendment. Critics are angry about how it was passed, snuck into a huge agricultural bill without review by a committee. <laughs> Wait, someone, someone just attached this language protecting genetically modified food makers into a bigger, unrelated bill. That isn't all. Yesterday, Monsanto announced its quarterly earnings. The world's largest seed maker revealed that its profits rose 22% in their second quarter. Looks like there's something other than GMO corn growing, and that's Monsanto's profits.